I'm going to show you a great trick. Recently, I bought this 1600 kV brushless motor and I was going to make my first scratch build plane. But I was unsuccessful due to the problems which I faced because of the prop save arrangement that is in here. Um, as we know, the most common problem with prop savers is that when the airplane turns and the motor also turns, due to the movement of inertia of this uh, propeller, the propeller slides off to one side, either this one or this one. And with this, uh, because of this, the o-ring also slips and it comes out, and your aircraft meets a fatal accident. But uh, therefore, I hated prop savers. I'm hating them, and uh, I wanted to try prop adapters because they will have, they will fix this to it. Uh, but the problem was that from the, uh, I was not able to find uh, this. This shaft was too short and uh, there was no way that I can install a prop adapter to it and I was also not ab uh, able to find this shaft uh, anywhere uh, means in India therefore I was I was trying to make something make some arrangement on my own and here is one arrangement you can see this I've made this prop adapter myself what it, what it actually will do is uh, it will sit on this over here and will be Tighten with these screws, and then you can put your prop propeller on top of it over here, like this, and you can tighten it. It be, it, it it will become a prop adapter. The prop adapter arrangement that I made. This is the base. This will be the base actually, and this is made up of the uh, this is made of the parts of two pen actually. This one is a Parker pin, and uh, this is the top portion of it the front portion actually and uh, which goes inside and the refill go come means goes inside from here what I did is I found that this easily slides inside uh, fits inside uh, sits in, uh, on top of this and slides on that and uh, so I made two holes over here and here uh, with the so that I can make it sit over here and using the screws that are there in the prop saver I can tighten it with the motor so I made this thing and then uh, with another the front part of another pen you can see over here this was the pen actually and the front part of this I cut it off and uh, uh, slide it inside over here and fix it with glue now it's sitting uh, inside this it means this this two have become one unit and the front part also had the uh, actually the gripper the rubber which is there and so I actually for this pen there was a blue gripper and this was from a different pen of uh, color red and so I also cut the gripper which was long and uh, installed it over here now this gripper also aids to the uh, it also grips the more motor and makes it sit firmly on that on top of it and so now you have a very cheap homemade makeshift prop saver uh, what it I'll, I'll show you how to install it you just need to uh, make it sit over here and fix the screws then it's just a matter of uh, inst uh, installing it installing the propeller just install the propeller like this and then using the top part of the pen which was there of this pen you can then uh, tighten the propeller on top of this prop adapter so when this is sitting on top of here like this you have your own prop adapter which you can use on top of a prop saver without changing anything in the motor uh, just pardon me because of this uh, just cardboard piece I fixed it just to have this thing sit properly on top of it without rocking to the sides and uh, this is it I'll show you the running now okay now I'll show you the running of it uh, as you can see the prop adapter is sitting on top of the prop saver and, it's, and it has been tightened with the screws of the prop saver and uh, on top of this adapter there is a 7 into 5e propeller which has been fixed and tightened with this thing now it's working perfectly even though there is some bit of uh, uh, and it's, it's a little bit unbalanced but as the propeller as the motor turns um, at a higher rpm 
it gets balanced uh, itself I will show you the running of it now so it's working perfectly and whenever you need to replace the propeller you can simply de-screw this and take out the propeller from here this rubber grips really helps uh, that's it thank you